What's up, V-Man 1313, and welcome to today's how-to video. And today's little video is about downloading files to your device. And in particular, an Apple device. I have my fiance's iPad she let me borrow. And so today we're going to go and see how to download some of the files that I've published. And really this should, in theory, work with most files that people have put up, or at least give you a good idea of how to get those. So first we're going to go to Safari on an Apple. And if you go to, let's say, um, Facebook, you can go to my Facebook page and th that Facebook page will send you to this site. So really wherever your GPX KML or KMZ file is, that's what you want to find, uh, get there. So when you go to my VMAN 1313 group page, make sure you're on the group, group page. Um, let's say you go down to um, here. I put this to show you. Let's go to the GBAT. So you're looking for the Georgia Belt Adventure Trail. And you can read about it a little bit. I know I put a lot of stuff there. Just some people like it. Uh, some people just are looking for that place to click. And so that takes you to here. So that's where we are here on the iPad. And we'll just go in order here because some of these are different. So I'm going to go ahead and hit the click to download. You'll see the sticker that I have for it, the, um, the map, the description of it, the disclaimer. Make sure you read the disclaimer of any. A lot of places have disclaimers because people are crazy out there. And um, make sure you agree to it and then you can hit click and download. Now some of my files I have put on Dropbox. And so this is actually the easiest because you just click download, direct download, make sure it's asking, do you want to download? And when you say download, it's a yes. And that's it. You've downloaded it. I'll show you where it's at in a second. Let's go back and I'm going to hit and download all of them. So again, click on the disclaimer. There's a map of it. I need to switch those around and make it look more uh, thing. Disclaimer, make sure you agree. Click on the link. This one takes you to the Dropbox. Download, download, yes. And that's that. Pretty simple. Pretty simple. Um, there's one of these that's different. That's why I wanted to do all of them. My fingers don't always want to. There's the sticker, there's the map, the disclaimer. Make sure you read it and agree. Download. This is also Dropbox. So, download, direct download yes please and thank you and then the next one is the one that's on a different and this is the one that throws everybody so my west georgia adventure loop yes i've been working on some more uh, west georgia adventure loop sticker map description and then the disclaimer if you agree click on it and this one's the one that throws people off so you have this and that's why i started moving stuff to my dropbox because it's it was it seemed to be a lot easier for people um, you don't want to open this. I think what happens is a lot of newbies, new people to this, and I don't mean that in a bad way. You know, we're all newbies at one point or another. A lot of people think that you just um, open the file. It just opens. But there always needs to be an app. You know, things don't just open to open. There needs to be an app that can read it. And so in this case, what we're going to do first is let me keep showing you how to download you have an open with, and I think a lot of people try to click on that, connect more apps, yada, yada. Now, what you want to do is download. You're trying to get this down to your device. So there you go. Do you want to download? Yes, please. And then that's it. You've downloaded it. So make sure you click on that. Um, I already did it, so I don't want to do it again. Um, you want to click on that arrow with a line under it. It's a download button. Um, and that's pretty common for a lot of places. And so that's what you end up with. So now, to make sure we have them on, you need to go to where your files are. I think it's a file manager. And usually it opens up your recent, and there they are. That's all the files I just downloaded. The West Georgia Adventure Loop, um, the Coast of Crest, the Georgia Belt, and the Georgia Adventure Trail. And so, there they are. Now, how to open them, I've made other videos, but um, you can really double-click on them. And again, I don't know what to do with it. 
you have to have an app. When you click this little arrow up, it opens up and it shows you apps that might be able to open it. I have Osman here and there's Gaia. So if you click on one of those, there's Osman that I use and Gaia that most people use. So when you click on it, it opens up Gaia and it shows you the file that you were looking at. Well, I have other stuff put on here, so that's why it's showing you a whole lot more than, than that. But, um, yeah. Um, let's get out of this one. Done. Um, they're all going to be the same. Oops. Upload, or that up button. I don't know why. It's, it's a square with an up button. There's Gaia. And there's my Osman. Those are the files that, those are apps that can open GPX, KML, and KMZ files. And so, yeah, that's it. So, hope this has been a very easy and, and useful video for you. And if you have any questions, please uh, let us know here on the uh, Man 1313 adventure page. I've uh, got some pretty good knowledgeable people on here that are very willing to help and are usually helping in the right way. And that's a rare thing these days, I know. So, yeah, come on over, check it out. Find some files and get out and explore. It's V-Man.